Welcome to today's web blog, where we'll discuss keeping your data safe in the cloud. I'm Mike Flaherty, Systems Engineer with Online Tech, and I'll be walking you through a high-level overview of data backup in the cloud. When it comes to backing up data, businesses think first of local backup, maybe with tape, uh, maybe off-site tape backup. This is a great first step, but can be a lengthy, lengthy process to restore uh, data and tape failures could wreak havoc uh, in the restore activity. So today I want to talk about option number one, which would be uh, simple backup. We'll touch on uh, option two and three in future video blogs, um, but I want to really focus on simple off-site backup today. You'll notice that I've crossed off uh, local backup. Uh, we just don't consider local backup a viable option today as a sole source of backup. So uh, we'll focus today on off-site backup. Um, so let's dive in. We all know we need to back up our data. Uh, data is money. Now imagine that your data and servers are located in an office building and a major fire breaks out. You have no access to the building data servers for days or weeks. Um, th there could be barricades, blockades, um, and, and there could be safety concerns which would not allow you to have, uh, have access to that building at all. Um, so your, your data could be in there destroyed or intact, uh, destroyed by fire or water. Uh, you need a solid backup plan. Or even worse than a, than a fire, an earthquake or hurricane could wipe out your data, servers, or office. So you have to make sure that your data is in the safe zone, uh, like Michigan, and online tech uh, data centers are in Michigan. Uh, so just how safe do you need to keep your data? Well, let's look at how much it will cost to protect your data, uh, how soon you need to recover your data. Um, let's look at the next slide to find out the answer to these questions. Ideally, any business would like their data and applications to exist in the active-active zone. That's up in the top left. Uh, where the application recovery is in seconds. This active-active solution comes with a very high cost and it can be very complex. Many companies run in the bottom right zone. Uh, so down in the bottom lower right, they, they're using tape backup, maybe with off-site backup. You know, while tape has been a great backup method for years, many customers don't regularly test their data, a backup restoration procedures, and, and this puts them at great risk. So online tech feels a great place to start and then focus on as a solid backup plan in the feasible region. Here in the yellow feasible region, we start off with uh, off-site tape, tapeless backup. And that's, again, illustrated in the yellow zone. This is really the first major step in, in getting serious about backing up your data using off-site tapeless backup. Feasible means capable of being done or carried out, or put another way, um, being dealt with successfully. Online tech uses the same off-site backup systems and software to back up our company data as we use for yours. And we regularly test the backup data and conduct full data restoration exercises to ensure that the data protection methods we use work. So how do we back up that data? For the majority of our customers, our off-site backup solutions is really the perfect fit. We examine the following items when we talk to customers and gather their requirements for building an, a, a solution for off-site data backup. We look at the amount of data and how much data is changing over time, uh, network bandwidth, uh, data restoration methods, operating systems, databases, uh, number of restore points needed, as well as retention policies for uh, archive data. When combined with a, a dual data center model, the off-site backup solution we propose uh, and utilize is unbeatable. In this picture, you see the Mid-Michigan Data Center on the top right and our Ann Arbor Data Center on the, bottom, uh, on the bottom right. Your data resides in either location and is backed up to the other one. And this all goes across our network cloud. The data centers are connected by private high-speed gig fiber. And these also sit across multiple power grids. Uh, so that really boosts your availability and resiliency. Under the hood, 
uh, for, this, for this backup process, we use the following technologies to accomplish our backup solutions. We use R1 soft for physical or virtual servers, and we use Veeam for the virtual hosts. R1 soft, uh, R1 soft is an industry leader um, of backup software across data centers and service providers. It provides backup protection to virtual or physical hosts and is agent-based, uh, provides near continuous data backup protection. R1 soft supports Windows and Linux operating systems as well as Microsoft SQL and MySQL databases. Um, so R1 soft is, is just a, a solid platform uh, to do backup and backup and recovery for uh, physical or virtual hosts. Now, for strictly virtual environments, Online Tech uses something called Veeam. And Veeam is truly a revolutionary product. Um, most sysadmins or storage admins agree that Veeam has changed the way they think about backing up a virtual host. Uh, Veeam provides 100% reliability of data integrity. Uh, it can provide five-minute RTO and RPOs. And it saves a ton of money on backup disk space. Uh, using built-in deduplication. So if you're running multiple VMware hosts today, um, Veeam really provides the number one solution in the industry uh, for backing up VMware jobs. Well, thanks for uh, watching the video blog. Uh, stay tuned for the next segment where we'll dive deeper into DR strategies and SAM replication. I'm Mike Clarity with Online Tech. Thank you.